Ahem! Today, I'm going to tell you the story of the Thousand Year Door. An awfully long time ago, in a strange and far-off land, a big bustling town thrived. It was a town where all people lived very happy lives. It was said that the town was very prosperous. But one day, tragedy befell this blessed place. A great cataclysm struck the town and its people. Is this the beginning of Shrek? Darkness filled the skies and the earth roared and shook. It was as if the very world had come to a violent end, but end in but a single night. The town sank into the depths of the earth. Oh, it's the Wind Waker. Must you unmind me? Many moons rose and set. Stories of the town passed into the pages of fairy tales, and when the town site no longer held relics of the past, people gathered on that spot and built a new town. If people could see your hand motions. But word soon spread among the people who moved in that an ancient city lay deep underground, and that a magnificent treasure rested there. Indeed. This is the tale of the fabled treasure of Rogueport. Yes, this is where it begins. In the sea town of Rogueport, the tale of the quest for the legendary treasure and the thousand year door starts here. I'll voice the hag, you can voice Peach. Oh, boy. Is that a noose? <laughs> this is you. Oh. Finally, I've. <laughs> Did you press A? No, it's on the I come all the way here on holiday, only to be stuck with Toadsworth. It's so stifling. Once in a while, I'd like the chance to look around on my own and see what I want. <laughs> is that a noose? <laughs> that is a noose. But now that I'm doing it, all I see is that this town is a very, um, distinct flavor. Oh, hey. Missy. Oh, Missy. Missy! Do you mean me? Yes, you, Missy. Won't you buy something? I have a wide assortment of knickknacks and doodads. Knickknacks and doodads and doodads. Oh, well, um... Well, that's a pretty box. What's inside it? It is said that this box holds a map that shows where a legendary treasure sleeps, but the box has a magic lock that can be opened only be opened by a pure noble heart. As you can see, it won't open for one such as myself. That's paraphrasing. Yes. Ooh. I know. If the box will open for you, Missy, then you may have whatever is inside. I'm sure that whatever is in there is of no use to someone like me. So, Missy, take this box in your hands and see what happens. Um. What's the harm? What could possibly go wrong? I will try to open it. And then oh! the ark of, then the ark of the covenant was opened. <laughs> My face! Welcome everyone to Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door, one of my favorite games of all time. I've never played this. Hashtag #remaster thousand year door. <laughs> uh, it's a bit of a movement started I... by Arlo. I actually, I had the opportunity to get this when I was, like, in elementary school, but my, uh, my mom's boyfriend was like, get Star Fox Adventures instead, because you'll find, you'll find the Mario game. This, <laughs> this was when the, this was when the Wii was current, by the way, so, um, that should tell you, like, th this was at a GameStop when they still sold GameCube games. Um, and we were like, oh yeah, um, you know, and I, I was like, okay. Like, I'll get Star Fox Adventures because I want this, and I also want Thousand Year Door, but I'll see the Mario game again someday, and now Thousand Year Door is, like, expensive, <laughs> and... Uh, yeah, I have my own history with how I came across this game, which I will share when the time comes. Uh, Alex Log. I'm Alex, this that is just, Log. That just sounds like <laughs> what happens when you come to my house and don't flush the toilet. <laughs> Ew. Oh, but I am just so happy that we get to play this game on the channel, and I I, I really hope that uh, the remaster Thousand Year Door movement uh, kind kind of gets through to Nintendo. At least make a another Paper Mario game in the style of this game if you're not going to remaster this one. Implying Nintendo listens to their fans. They do, but that doesn't mean they have to follow through. Anyway. Uh oh. Oh, progress could not be saved. 
Current game progress has not been saved. Um, yeah, we should probably use my memory card then. All right, well, we changed the memory card, so hopefully this works and we can actually start the game. Yeah. I, I, I can't I can't wait to play this. This this is like one of my favorite games of all time. Oh, here we go at here we are at Mario's house. And here comes the paracarry. You you, you you can do him if you want. Okay. Mail call This is what I That was his mind. only line in the entire game and you nailed it. Oh, nice. <laughs> oh, here I go to check the mail. I hope I get some fan mail this time. No, no, just, just, just bills for Luigi and a love letter from Mario. Hey, bro, check it out. I got a letter from Princess Peach arrived for you. Oh, I got oh, 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 check. Oh gosh, I've read that wrong. Yes, you did. Shut up. Oh, wait, wait. You're not doing both of the brothers. Well, Mario doesn't talk. Well, okay. I'll just read it to you. How's that sound? Luigi, that just sounds, uh, illegal, because it's my mail. That's a federal offense. <laughs> implying, <laughs> implying that, that the rule of law is strong in the Rushroom Kingdom. The Rushroom Kingdom? The Mushroom Kingdom. Okay. Right. Ahem, now let's see here. Considering that, that, uh, that Princess Peach regularly goes on to out playing sports with a literal terrorist leader then who has threatened her life multiple times oh, oh hello there mario i am now on holiday traveling in the mushroom kingdom in my travels i came into possession of a mystical map a treasure map actually also there is a cake recipe on the back it was inside a box i got from an old merchant in a town called rogueport but since it would be too difficult for me to try to go find treasure all by myself I thought you could help me to hunt for it. You will, of course, won't you? Help me, please! I'm too lazy! <laughs> I've included the map with this letter, so please bring it with you when you come home. I'll meet you at Rogueport. That means you MUST come, Peach. I do a pretty good Peach impression, huh, bro? <laughs> what, what do you know? It's true! There's a weathered old map in here with the letter. It's a kind of scary, bro. Uh, why am I doing like a super check show? It, check it out. Well, thank you for reading my mail. Hmm, this seems to look cool. Since I am illiterate, thank you for reading my mail for me. <laughs> oh, but here we are, Paper Mario, the Thousand Year Door. I, I, I'm, I'm just speechless. So I'll just continue talking. Yeah, this is like, out of the good Paper Mario games, this is the only one that I haven't played. Well, Alex tells me Color Splash is good, but I haven't well, played that it's, one yet. Well, it, it's, it's decent. Uh, the the, the humor, humor's on point, gameplay is pretty fun, but the battle system is kind of pointless. Prologue, Would, a rogue's welcome. Well, that still sounds better than Sticker Star, which might have been literally the most... Bad. pointless of a game I've ever played in terms of not even being not even having the audacity to be unfun just like or no, not unfun just bad please wake up sir the town you'd been speaking to is coming to view uh, this this is I, I'm, I'm I don't plan on reading all the dialogue because then we'd be here all freaking day just just mostly the the main characters yeah but anyway here we are arriving well, in Rogueport give the viewers some time to see what it is well <laughs> I, jeez, man, this this really takes me back, because uh, I have a pretty interesting way of how I came across this game. Uh, first off, uh, one of my first Mario game was Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga, so I I very much fell in love with Mario RPGs. God, stop with that. skipping through everything. They they can pause. Oh, and, they, okay. and it's really not important. Uh, but anyway, uh, then I, f at one time I was like at Michigan at, at this hotel and they p had like an N64 in the hotel room and, uh, then I discovered Paper Mario and, uh, yeah, it was, oh. it was pretty much, uh... Hey, I was gonna read that. He's just telling you about the I know, box. but he, but, but the text box indicated that he had a funny, like, accent or something. Well, yeah, but, uh, like I said, I'm not, I'm... If you if you if you want to get all the dialogue, play the game yourself. Anyway, 
you, you want to voice a you want to voice like uh, the girl Goomba? Hey, what do you want? No, not like that. What does a Goomba sound like? I don't know. Like, me. Hey, what do you want? Get away from me, freak! That's. Oh wait, you want me to voice a Goomba? If you want, if I'm you mad. since you seem to be so authoritative oh, on what Goombas I'll, sound like. Oh, I mean, well, it doesn't sound like a toad. Well, and it, it, th th this character's got attitude. Anyway, I'll let you try. Attitude. Oh God, don't don't say the word attitude. I'm just gonna do a Sonic voice. Hey, what do you want? Ah, uh, <laughs> it's hard to make it like sound gruff, but or, not gruff, but like at authoritative. Hey, what do you want? Get away from me, freak! Oh my gosh, people are gonna hate you if that's the Goombella voice. Yes. <laughs> oh gosh. Uh, um. This this guy's kind of a big oaf. Big the cat. Uh, well, not like that. Oh. Uh, oh, oh, come off it, you airhead! I know it's tough for you, but don't play dumb with me. I've seen you walking around town asking for information about the Crystal Stars. Well, now I'm doing the asking, so be a good girl and tell us what you know right now. Never! I don't have. Oh my well, I'm god. Try, I'm, I forgot the voice I just did. I don't have anything to oh say Oh my to gosh, you. now you're just sounding like Yoda. <laughs> hey, th think, think, probably like... I'm not being a Gemini. A talk, 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 talk like Jessica from, from Captain Underpants. Oh, like that. Maybe. Okay. Maybe. Never. Well, not, well, don't, I don't, don't have don't anything think. to say to you, creeps. Ew. Don't there. touch my heart. <laughs> <laughs> yes, we're just gonna roll with that as her new personality. Goomba one, I other Goomba. <laughs> I su I suppose it wouldn't be right if a sassy little lass like you met with an untimely demise. Wow. Be for everyone. <laughs> yeah. Bo bo <laughs> Boys, we're taking this firebrand to our fortress. <laughs> Got like a pillow fort. <laughs> As you command, Lord Crump, we're on it. We can give these the, the X not the voice we want, because they're they all look the same. N no, stop right there, you weirdos! I'll scream, really. Well, Mario's going to just let this happen. <laughs> Yahoo! Into the sea I go. <clears throat> well, if if I've learned anything from playing Kotor 2, it's it's that trying to help people well will have unintended consequences. <laughs> Out of the way, you scallywag! Move your ever-loving bones! Landlubber. Blimey! A fight? Corkin! <laughs> Ain't nothing so fun as watching some poor bloke have it out with his missus, eh? Am I right, mate? I don't know if you if you did that entirely right. Yikes! Looks like trouble over there! Probably best not to get involved, huh? I wouldn't meddle with other people's problems in this town, even if I had an extra life! Speaking of, let me borrow your head for a moment. <laughs> I have many lives! Not her! I'm a gamer! I don't have I don't have one life! Give I me your head! Lives. Give me your head, Green Toad! <laughs> We're just being off the rails here. Like I'd go anywhere with smelly lunatics like you. Not likely. Oh my gosh, you were terrible at this. But I, know. I love it anyway. Whoa! What do you think you're doing, chump? You think you can screw up my plans? Oh, are you talking to Mario? I'm a world of famous. God, it's always something. Looks like I'm gonna have to give you a little taste of the old Krumpa Bomb. Krumpa Bomb. <laughs> yep, here we go. Can't flee this fight. Battle time, Mr. Man. Just find a way to beat this freak of the week, okay? You don't need to drag it out so much. I mean, you got I'll the tone right. drag you out. Yeah. Well, anyway. Uh, yeah, this is our first fight, so I'm just gonna, you know, get get right to it. Sweet. Uh, yeah, this is... It's tutorial. I, I'm, I'm, I'm not going to be sitting here going through all the dialogue. We're just... We're, we, we just want to have some fun here. Got him on the ropes. Dude, seriously. I, I know. I'm just doing it because I can. I... jeez. You did it! Yes! Yes, I only drug that points. out because that's how it was written. Okay. 
Uh, anyway, that was our first battle, and, uh, yeah. <laughs> okay, you got a couple decent shots in, I'll give you that. But, unfortunately for you, that means... It's go time! Oh. Mario's a screwed. PUNISH HIM! <laughs> oh, God. Feel that vibrate. Well, pfft. Okay, yeah, stop vibrating. Stop. Oh, wait. No, wait. <laughs> Quick! This way! I'm gonna punch you if you keep doing You could've- that. if you just- if you just skipped ahead, I would've stopped. Phew, what a bunch of wounds. Let's just sneak out of here. What do you say? Anyway, moving right I mean, even now. if I don't try to drag it out, that manner of speaking just, like, lends itself to the enunciation, bro. Uh -huh. <laughs> Stop! Stop, papa! Papa. Where'd they go? Huh? You, Dalton! Did you see them? Did anyone? Oh, yes, my favorite uh, GameCube tech demo, X Not 128. Ah, oh, crud, they bolted. That's a, that's a deep cut Mario reference for all of y'all. Okay. Anyway. And so, here we are, standing in front of the noose. Here we are, in front of the noose. I want to know if you can get. A goose. Goose. <laughs> wow, mister! You totally saved me! Thanks! I have just got to give you a little reward. Uh, oh! Mario doesn't, uh, bend that way. <laughs> As in, downward. <laughs> yes. <laughs> My name's Goombella. I'm a student at the University of Goom. Nice to meet ya. So, uh, who are you? I'm a Mario! It's a me! Mario? Wait, you mean, like, that famous guy? Like, the rapper Mario? No, that, 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 that was the, the, the rapper formerly known as Mario. Can I tell you how confused I was as a kid when I googled Mario and, like, I found results for some rapper? Yeah. <laughs> um, wow. I can't believe I met you here. Cool. Anyway, no offense, but it looks like you just rolled into town yourself, right? I... You're such a tourist. Wow. Me? I already hate it here. There are freaks and weirdos everywhere. It's nasty. Oh my gosh. You're if just, you're getting... You're just, you're just doing bratty and catty, but super slow for some reason. It's it's a it's a it's a manner of speaking that lends itself to slower pronunciation. You can do it faster. I mean, I know the place is called Roadport, so I should not like that. So I, I mean, I know the place it, is called Roadport, but, Road Park, but yeah, there, there you go. I mean, you can. It's just fun. Well, never... I I don't I I don't want the part to go on for two hours. <laughs> I'd never come to a place like this if there weren't some legendary treasure here. If you don't- Oh! My- Oh! Look in the background! What? You're- Oh. See? The Mafia. Sunshine- Mario Sunshine is canon. What? You're looking for the legendary treasure too? Seriously? I guess I'm just going to have to kill you. Whoa, 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 bucko! What you got there? I swear, I'm probably gonna end up murdering Logan before the end of this. Oh my gosh! And how- I don't- Personally, I don't know how I haven't murdered you yet. As, isn't that a treasure map? You have to tell me where you got that. Princess Peach? What? Great hoogly boogly, if it isn't Master Mario! <laughs> <laughs> oof! Oof! St All right. Stay down, bro! Someone's gonna have to put in the Roblox oof. The boss sends his greetings. How's that robe taste, punk? Are you okay? That hurt. Those jerks! Do I need to do we my- We won't forget this! Do I need to do an old man voice? Uh, you can- you- you can do Toad's Worth if you want. Bit of a coincidence, bumping into one- into one another in this sort of place. Mmm. Ho ho! Or I should- should I do a Yoda voice for Toad's Worth? If you want to, but 
Just stop making it so slow. So tell me, Master Mario, what in the world brings you to this wretched little burg? Mm. I uh, came here to to uh, murder somebody with that noose in the corner. Hmm. Ah, indeed. Princess Peach sent you a letter and a treasure map. Hmm. And she told you she'd meet you here in Rogueport. Hmm. Yes. Intriguing. Ah, uh, yes. Uh, now tell me where she is, old man, or <laughs> Mario's going to send you to the Mafia over there. Luminous pixels we are, not this crude decode. <laughs> Sorry, you're asking me where Princess Peach is? Mm. I was about to ask you that. We stopped in this town to acquire a spot of fuel for our ship, don't you know? Mm. <laughs> I, mean, I mean, he's more British, old man, but all right. Yeah, I, sh keep, I should do an Alfred, it. but this is so mismatched that I have to well, continue. Well, Tot Totesworth does, just never shows up again after this, oh, so. okay. Well, that's good, because this voice yes. is gonna grate on my throat at some point. I only took my eye off her for a moment. I often do keep my eyes on her. Mm -hmm. Oh, goodness. But as soon as I did, she vanished. Oh, you are a terrible caretaker, Totesworth. You know how headstrong she is, Mario. Mm hmm. I just assumed she'd be back momentarily. Mm. But at this point, I fear we must embrace the possibility that she's dead. I mean, she may never return. Mm. I've been at a loss as to what to do. I've been fraught with worry, I tell you. Ah, uh, yes. <laughs> Mario, I don't know what that hand motion's supposed to signify. He's saying hi. I'm sure he's not saying hi -el. I'm going to hurt you if you continue with that. But I'm feeling better with you here, Master Mario. Mm. <laughs> no. Surely we'll find her. Surely. I don't know. I'm getting tired of searching for this chick. Maybe it's about uh, time that you sent her the message from me. Um, yes, I, I think we should be seeing other people. In fact, I already am. <laughs> I'm a cheating on her with the Pauline. It's in a game theory video. That means it has to be correct, right? Oh, God. And totally not made up at all. That was terrible. But I, but I know my place, Master Mario. Mm, and this is not it. I leave this task up to you. I'm not... I'm not paid enough to do this. <laughs> in fact, I'm not paid at all. I believe I'll recline in the inn right over there and enjoy a spot of tea, perhaps. Mmm. In fact, I highly rec- Just drop on the inn! Ho ho! Yes, anyway, a little rest there will fill all your HP. I must say, though, the rest of this town is a bit rough. Yes, rough indeed. Yeah. Huff, I say. Huff, I say. Go, go run over, Goombella, in your 2003 Mario Kart and be like, Can't help being a Gemini. I'm sorry. I'm Please. so sorry. Just stop. Um, Princess Patch? Did he mean, like, Patch, the Mushroom Kingdom <laughs> princess? <laughs> the princess who always gets nabbed by Bowser, the Koopa King? The one you rescue because she's incompetent? You can go ahead and skip if I'm dragging too long. Wait a sec. This is crazy. Here's my number. Um, princess <laughs> Patch sent you that treasure map? Oh my goodness. Whoa. This is really intense. Well, where could she have gone then, do you think? You think maybe she got sick of waiting and went to find the treasure on her own? She better not have. Oh my goodness, I'm oh. tired of her getting kidnapped. Oh, oh, I know, Mario. Come with me. One of my professors is here researching that treasure. We'll show you him your map. My god. God, you can drag out this dialogue. Ah, if we start looking for the treasure, then maybe we'll catch up to Princess Patch. You know what? I'm gonna voice Goombella from now on. No! <laughs> this is my role! You can have Gray. All We're all good then. Let's go, Mario! Goombella joined your party. I am replacing Goombella at the first opportunity. You better not! <laughs> Oh, uh, anyway, basically, I, she talks. Uh, this isn't a... I, like I said, I'm skipping over the tutorials, man. She's not saying anything important. Go, that's Goom, go, Goomther the Goomba. You know what? Great. You're gonna make me play through this game that I'm, like, 
watching you play anyway. So, first off, we gotta go find my professor. This is, the thing is, since I just, This is what he looks like. This is what Professor Frank guy looks like. Anyway, look, 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 we, we, we need to get some stuff done. Freeze! Not in our step. Don't come this way. Some complete jerk just made me bumped into me and made me lose a contact lens. I'm looking for it right now, so don't you dare move. Me tink me loose contact lens. <laughs> don't move an inch. <laughs> Squitch. Ah, you idiot! You stepped on it, my poor contact lens. I told you not to move. Don't your stupid ears work? What were you thinking? Jeez, game Dark designers. side points gained. <laughs> this is your fault. Now I have to buy a new contact lens, but you're gonna pay for it. Compensate me, Mr. Clumsy. No, I don't have to give in to this. <laughs> oh, jeez. Just gonna block the west side. Whoop, 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 whoop. Anyway. Yeah, this, uh, this, uh... Does does that if you stay still does she find it? No, no, you have to go through this turf war between the Pianta Syndicate and the Robos heating up. Apparently, best stay indoors. You know, I never thought there'd be a Mario game where, wait, wait, okay, I didn't, I didn't see, I didn't pay enough attention to that. But I never thought there'd be a Mario game where gang wars were a plot element. Oh yeah, you help the mafia in this game. Anyway, we're anyway we're ordering a contact lens. Mm. Yeah, I'm just I'm just setting this up. Uh, I, but dude, if you if you keep <laughs> checking out Goombell's dialogue, gee uh, fella, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, I'm also I'm just those are mustaches working. and not open mouths, as I learned recently. Oh, really? Yes. So you watched Did You Know Gaming? No, I didn't. Okay. Well, anyway, let's see here. It was I uh, saw it on Reddit. On r slash miss, rest, uh, what was it? Miss Red Sprites, I think. Hmm. Oh. Hey, by the way, you see that safe block? I guess. Did, you, I'm. I'm. I'm well, not going I don't. To I'm not. Dialogue. I don't see which one. I don't see what's important dialogue. Um. Hey, what's your beef, pal? Yeah, I'm talking to you. It's pepper beef. Mario, you gotta wake up. That guy just stole half of your coins. Oh! Mario, you're such a dummy. That is so lame. Ugh, I hate this town. Mario's about to go shank a, a person. <laughs> oh, jeez. Mario is a coming for I'm a gonna you. run you over in my 2003 Mario Kart and be like, can't help being a Gemini. Logan? What? Shut up. I am kidding, but please get over get over your 2003 Honda Civic that you crashed into a pole. I wasn't. No, it's meme. Yeah. Well, don't post cringe, bro, or we'll lose subscriber. Alex, first of all, it's loose subscriber. Second of all, if if you when did you care about not posting cringe? <laughs> well. I want to make a high quality Paper Mario LP so that people will enjoy this and uh, want to remaster the game. Can you step on the bugs like in Half Life? No. Aww. Hey. Hey. Oh. My, my name is Darkly. I like dim places. Now I'm done talking for now. A fun, Darkly. <laughs> uh, let's see, what else? Alright, might as well just begin the game. Ugh. Oh, hi. There you are. Professor Franklay! Who's it? Who's there? Who wants me? Ah, yes. You. Now you, uh... I've seen your face before. Yes, the face. Wait for it. Just a moment. Don't tell me now. Silence! I'll get it right. I had something for this. Um, it's not Groombriel. Er, uh, it's not Elizagoom. Aha! I've got it. You're Goombella, aren't you? You were in my archaeology class last year, am I right? 
Wow, yeah, sir. That's me. I'm Goombella, Junior at Yo Goom. Go Goombas! Of course, I remember you. Not to toot my horn, but I'm pretty good at remembering. You, though, you stick out in my mind because you were such an exceptional student. And that guy behind you is... Who? Mario's insulted! Mario! Professor hates Mario, you know, the famous one! Mario, Mario! Oh, my apologies. I'm such a bookworm, I haven't a clue about what's hip right now. I haven't, I haven't gone outside since 1983. You don't really even have hips, none of the Goombas really do. No comment. In any case, what sort of errand brings you two to a place like this? We were hoping you'd tell us about the legendary treasure said to be a below rogue part. I thought that if anyone knew anything about it, you would, Professor Frankly. Of course I know about it. The reason I came here was to study that very subject. But why do you tykes want to learn about the legendary treasure? You know that most say it's a little more than a fairy tale, don't you? Archaeologists and historians have to search for truth in those fairy tales, though. Me, I believe the legendary treasure truly does exist, and I really want to find it. Good point, and well made. In that case, I'll cooperate with you however I can. First of all, about the treasure. There are mysteries surrounding it. Some say it's an infinitely vast treasure hoard, while others say it's a magical item. Some books say it's actually a monster, while still others claim it's an empty chest. So many different theories. Obviously, it's impossible to define the truth among them. Oh, don't don't talk about theories. But all agree on one point. To find the treasure, one must have the crystal stars. To find the treasure of yore, take the seven crystal stars to the thousand year door! You mean the crystal stars in that old saying that super elderly people pass down? Indeed, the same. As the saying goes, if you want to find, to find the legendary treasure, you first must collect the seven crystal stars. Hold the magical map aloft before the entrance to the thousand year door. Then the stars will light the way that leads to the stones of yesterday. Yeah. A lot of the lore I've read says the lure it says that if this magical map is taken to the doorway, then it'll show you where to find the crystal stars. Correct. And the thousand year door is supposedly here, deep beneath this town. You know, Goombella, you're really annoying. Yet the critical piece of the puzzle, the magical map, is lost. If only we had that map. But we do have it, Professor. Oh well, not we, exactly. Mario has the magical map. What? Really? You you actually have it. Could I just take a quick look at it if you don't mind? Please give it back. Astounding. This is it. The real thing. The one and only magical map. Oh, you got stuff on it. Your saliva. <laughs> you, son, are my hero. You're great, fantastic, wonderful, even. <laughs> With this, we can find the crystal stars just by holding this aloft before the legendary door. Right on, Professor. Good golly, what are we doing just sitting here then? Goombella, Mario. Off we must go, this instant! Let's take the magical map to the legendary door! Well. So. How are you doing today? Um. You know, I, I was gonna say something and then there's a cutscene and then you skip some dialogue. Well, uh, he's, he's literally just saying to get get go into the fight. Uh, now, now he's just trying to do a tutorial. Alright. Okay, just gotta be careful there. <laughs> Alright, anyway. Yeah, yeah, because I already know about action commands. Alright, I know how to go down a pipe, old man. Let me go down. I'm a plumber. Should have given him the unit voice. Lord, no, because we have to go back to him. A lot. Are we ever gonna save? Oh, yeah. Hey, hey, man, what's up? Who's the hottie you got there with you? 
What's up, baby? Why don't you hang with us for a while? We play real nice. You want to do that one? Man, what's a fine-looking Goomba doing with a tubby mustache man like that? Oh my gosh, that is horrible. Oh, it is like so sweet that you boys think I'm cute. Seriously. Yeah, guys like you make me feel like totally barfing. Now get out of our way. Ouch, that was ice cold. You, what, you too good for us? Come off it, sister. You gave two of them the same voice. Shut up. N nobody sings us like that. Nobody. Let's get them. Oh, they're not characters. I just wanted to voice that snare because it was funny. Nah, anyway. Basically, a tutorial on, how on what to fight. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Uh, let's see. Mm, I'm gonna jump on you. I'm a super stylish. Mm -hmm. Well, I failed that. And then you're gonna have. To... Oh. Yep. Yep. Well, that just happened. You gotta watch out for the pickle albagoo. The pickle what? You know? Okay. The the German World War One hats. With the little spikes. Okay. Anyway, I'm a super stylish and got 10 star points. Ooh wee! Well. Ha! Later on, losers! That felt awesome! Are you ready, Mario? There are plenty more when I came from. Blah 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 blah. First strike, okay. Moving on with the my first life. First strike, yards! Street Fighter, not three. All right, I'm just just checking. Oh, come on! This is the the platform of eternal waiting. Cause Mario cannot jump in Paper Mario games to save his life. Yeah. Oh, I was gonna say at least it's not like you have to have all of your party members near the exit. Like in like Kotor one where it's like you must gather your party members. Well, maybe if their AI wasn't getting stuck. Nah, A AIs don't or um, your partners don't really matter much in the field. Mm -hmm. they, 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 they Did you hear that, Goombella? Well, especially Goombella. She's she was always my least favorite partner. Don't don't at me, bro. Uh, just yeah, I, I I didn't learn until like fairly recently like any good strats you could do with her and outside of flavor text she's not much useful in the field wait so she's basically just goombario yeah she's basically this game's goombario you you a lot of the partners are just kind of versions of of uh, partners from the last game because you you'll get I mean you'll get a babam you'll get a koopa you'll get a goomba but you but they do mix it up anyway just gonna keep on fighting. Get an item. Oh look! I found a secret. Woo! Anything interesting happened with you lately, Logan? Um no, I'm sure there's gonna be more dialogue that Um N I mean, not really. Not that I want to say. I mean, you know I don't like talking about life events too much because it's not going to be relevant by the time this video comes out. Oh, well, then why don't I finish how I came across pa Paper yeah. Mario's A Thousand Year Door? You do then. that. Well, uh, anyway, like I said, Michigan. I had They had an N64 in there, and I played th a little bit of the original Paper Mario. I died to King Goomba because I could not figure out... Uh, how how to beat him? And he just like totally wombo comboed me. And I, I was really kind of put off when I first played Paper Mario because all I played was Superstar Saga before that, and I, I was I was wondering why I couldn't dodge. Because in the original Paper Mario, you can't you can't even block until like at after the prologue, which is like which really threw me off. But uh, then, then of course, you know, my mom hey, com comes back in, and then she finds out that me playing Paper Mario on on the TV for for about half an hour cost about fifty oh, bucks. Oh yeah, those uh, hotel 
uh, Nintendo 64 units. I, I remember that. Yeah. I'm like, well, guess what? This is the modern... Because I remember when I found one of those, I was like, guess what? This is the modern age. I have my own gaming equipment I can take here <laughs> portably, and I can play Pokemon Diamond. Yeah, I don't really see much appeal in, in playing those, that, I, unless you've never played a retro console, because you can't carry your it was, data with Well, you. it was, I think, I think that it was probably a bigger deal back when they were current, and it was like, oh, you know, it's playing, like, you know, game, like, console games without having to bring your console, or if you didn't have them, like, but... Nowadays. Anyway, let, 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 let's let's put a pin in my story yeah. as we get to this cutscene. Oh. Hey, you. Can you hear me? You can? That must mean you're the hero of legend. A me? Uh, oh, I, I, I am a hero, but of legend. Okay, Mario confirmed for, hallucin uh, for having hallucinations. Only the great hero of legend can hear my voice. Yeah, everyone else, nothing. Mario, what are you? What I'm gonna are you hurt you if to? you if you if you keep. Uh, I, I I am about to revoke your Goombella privileges. I'll S revoke your life. <laughs> See, long ago, an evil spirit cast a curse on me, locking me in this box. I was bummed. <laughs> I've been here ever since, waiting a long, long time for the hero to come by. What a boomer, man! So yeah. Anyway, big guy, what brings a hero like you to a place like this? Oh god. This is getting oddly intimate. Uh, Mario, a word with you? I'm not exactly confident that we can trust this box. <gasps> Professor Frankly confirmed to be boxist. <laughs> I think he just had a bad experience with the box ghost a while ago. And... <laughs> I am the box ghost. <laughs> that or Solid Snake. I think it may be best not to mention that we're looking for the crystal stars. No drat. I just said it out loud! What's wrong with me? <laughs> oh yeah? Searching for the crystal stars, are you now? So you really are a hero. I would, uh, I, you know what? I, uh, what's his name? Frankly, I'd tell you to commit seppuku to restore your honor, but you have no arms anyway, so. Anyway, he wants us to get a key. Oh, wow. Well, what do you think we ought to do, Mario? Hmm. Well, I know my boat goes to finding that key. I'm sure it's around here somewhere. Come on, being stuck in a box is no picnic. I'm counting on you, oh great legendary hero. I'm a super famous. Do you think they'll let me into the Legend of Zelda? I'm a very super famous, super famous. Woohoo! Whoa, whoa, whoa. You brought the key? Yes. Oh man, I owe you big. Yes, think, ha, huh, think nothing. Wait, <laughs> wait, he owes us, he owes us, a, he owes us big, he owes us an, an action figure of Big the Cat. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy, did you fall for it. I burned you. What are you, what do you think I was going to help you? What are you doing? Instead, I'm going to spread a little of the suffering I've endured in that stupid box. Yeah, sorry, but those are the blocks. I'm gonna cast an evil, terrible curse upon you. Bagley, Bagley, Rule, you cursed! <laughs> Enjoy that curse, sucker! You got what you deserved! Anyway. Uh, basically, we can now turn it into a paper airplane. Yada yada. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah! He's made out of paper. That's a thing. <laughs> oh, but yeah. It, 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 we, we, we come across a couple of these boxes throughout the game. They give us paper abilities. So, uh, wow. Just wow. What was that guy's beef? You make me want to punch you every second you drag I'm it sorry, out. you're the one who did that stupid voice. I didn't drag it out, though. That doesn't ma mean it wasn't painful. Well, excuse me, princess.
Look at what? The pillars? Oh. It's the Thousand Year Door spoken of in the legends. I can't believe it's real. So the legends are all true. There it is, big as life. Come, let's move. Whoa, what's the deal with the deal with this weird pedestal, huh? What could it be, do you think? Hmm. Jump on it! Jump on it! Frankly. He's the legendary hero. <gasps> no. <laughs> oh no! I'm being sucked into the matrix! I don't even know what that is. is that, I was gonna say, is that how that works? I haven't seen those movies in a long time. Hell, what's oh. going on? Oh, is Mario becoming a god? <laughs> no, he's becoming a brown thing. Oh. Is this the ultimate power? Oh, this is- was this like the prototype of like the- the maps in Breath of the Wild? Hmm, I guess. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, there's- there's Hyrule Castle. Alright, well now we can go defeat Ganon. Alright, let's wrap this Let's Play up. <laughs> but first, a really awesome screen shattering effect. Whoa. Yeah! Anyway, now I got a special move, and we have the first location. <laughs> Professor, the map! I'm the map. Was... I'm the map. I'm the map. I'm the map. And what was with all those crazy lights? Information about the crystal stars appeared, and shining light okay. Mario. Yeah. We're, gonna, we're going back up to the surface. Hmm. I see. Is that one smug dude standing guard? Oh, we're gonna kill him later. Oh, okay. You understand it, Professor? My dear, of course I do. Firstly, about that light we saw shining on Mario. Okay, special move, yeah. A special move? Like a Shoryoken? Or a Hadouken? Well, Alex, you're gonna like have I, I I'm how much you wanna bet Alex has forgotten how to do this. Dude. I literally did it while we were testing it. Okay. The, this map has radar like functions. It now shows the location of a crystal star. A map that's a radar. And well, they, as long as it's not the Star Wars novel Crystal Star, then I I'm fine with that. It looks like the first crystal stars to be found in a place called the Petal Meadows. Petal Meadows? Yes, the area is a vast meadow that lies far to the east of Rogueport. To tell you the truth, I've always thought that place was a tad suspicious. The name Petal Meadows did come up from time to time in my research. Okay, fine, so we'll go there. Does anybody know how to get there or what? I'm fairly certain that somewhere beneath the city is a pipe to Petal Meadows. If you could just find that, you'd get there instantly. Pipe travel's efficient. It's also stinky! <laughs> Say, by the way, Mario, I'm curious. Where did you get that map, anyway? Huh? Uh -huh. <laughs> From Princess Peach. Really? Her Highness sent this to you, Mario? This Princess Peach. This wouldn't be her, would it? I can communicate images to you through speech. Actually, they, actually, Princess Peach isn't missing. He just, she's just right there in, in Frankly's word bubble. <laughs> Give her back. So it is her. Your princess came to see me the other day. She wanted to learn about the treasure. I told her about the crystal stars and my suspicions about Petal Meadows. It doesn't seem likely, but perhaps she tried to go to Petal Meadows on her own. You know, Professor, there was another suspicious group asking about the same thing. Hmm. But I can't imagine Princess Peach getting involved with them. Oh, please. All right, it's settled. Off to Petal Meadows you two go. If Princess Peach indeed went there, your first priority must be to catch up to her. 
Collecting the crystal sauce is a means to an end. That end is Princess Peach. Um, okay. So how much do you want to bet that, uh, aren't you coming, Professor? No. I'll stay in this town and ask around about Princess Peach and that suspicious gang. Besides, I doubt a shriveled old Goomba like me could handle the trials of the road. But you could become the road warrior. I mean, the toad warrior. You got it, Professor. Well, Mario, we're off. squad -la. Anyway, yeah. Anyway, he just gives us a badge. Yeah, I'll equip that in a minute. Hang on, I, I, I gotta carefully... You hey. got the hammer badge! No thanks. No thanks. Okay. You didn't talk me through it, thank goodness. Alright. Whoa. Okay, so, um, you know what I was, I, I, I had probably had things I was going to say, so now I'm realizing that games with a lot of dialogue really sometimes are not always most fun to, games to let's play, um, you know, maybe it, maybe it would be a bad idea to do those Knights of the Old Republic let's plays that I kind of wanted to do. Um, I'm never talking to you again, old man. <laughs> <laughs> You know, he, I think he has an affair with this with this toad. We could uh, we could ask him about it. No, because he only says one thing. There we go. All right, just getting grabbing some star pieces for the road. A glowing, mysterious light under the city smells like treasure. People. I mean, th this I'll probably I'll probably. I s I saw Mario get pickpocketed. I guess even superstars can be taken to the cleaners. Wonder how many coins that fat cat has on him anyway. The housekeeping. Door. I was wondering why, um, why Peach is so interested in these crystal stars. I have to imagine that maybe they just really need to. I, I maybe that's maybe she's such an inefficient ruler that stealing these priceless artifacts is the best way she can think of to boost her nation's economy. <laughs> wow. You don't think that she she's just bored and and wants to go on a treasure hunt for funsies? Uh, I think she knows what would happen if she even so much as steps outside her bedroom. <laughs> Actually, Bowser once kidnapped her from her bedroom. Steps out of her bed. She was in her bed. Steps out of her mother's womb. <laughs> I think I think Bowser's dad kidnapped her mom. And multiple points. Yeah, anyway. My name is Dazzle. Yeah. That's what I think this guy sounds like, apparently. <laughs> oh, we're gonna we're gonna be wanting one of these later. <laughs> uh, but yeah. Are we ever going to save? This is making me super paranoid. <laughs> All right, fine. I don't know. I mean, you can do whatever. It's just like because uh, I was about to get to the end of this part anyway. This part? Yeah. I, I figured we were just going to just record in big chunks and just chop it up in the editing. Because these are going to be huge episodes. Uh, We've been playing for a while, I feel like. 48 minutes. That thing's kind of soggy. Honestly, I just prefer to chop up episodes in editing anyway. Hmm. It seems to be almost inviting us to do something, doesn't it? But what? You could jump on it, but you totally ruin your shoes. So I just hammer it. Casual cruelty to animals. I jumped on it. Bloop. Bloop. Ouch, that hurt. Okay, you voice the translations. I'll just I'll voice the bloops. God, Mario's a jerk in this game. <laughs> oh, you haven't seen anything yet. Bloop, 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 bloop. Who just up and whack someone's tootsies like that? Blue, blue, blue. Somebody with some serious moxie, that's who. Blue, 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 blue. Would you look at that? It's some saucy mustached guy. <laughs> blue, 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 blue. Saucy. He's in for a war. He's in a world of hurt. Mmm, tasty. Blue, 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 I'll blue. give him a taste of the old tentacle trample. Okay. That's just tutorial stuff. Anyway, uh, did uh was this ever used in that in that stupid Mario is evil video? <laughs> I 
don't know. I've never I don't, seen that. I don't think MatPat talked about this, <laughs> which is just more proof that he's an absolute hack. Wow. Just look at me flip around. <laughs> Yes. Commit more animal cruelty, Mario. People are lining up to see it. Well, I mean, this is Rogueport. Yeah, I good don't point. think they have better anything. Better I guess when you have a noose in town square, your you, you, your populace isn't exactly the nicest. Bloop, bloop. <laughs> eh, but yeah, we'll pro we'll probably do what you said. Uh, cause uh, here we go. Oh. oh, here we go. Back over here, Mario's going to. Mario Do has a dead wish. Just <laughs> wait! <laughs> it looked like it was going to stay. Man, Mario can't platform today. Platforming machine broke. Well, anyway, I think this 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 will be the start of our adventure in the next part. Hmm.